In this video, you will learn multiplying negative numbers. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to master topics on algebra, start right now by subscribing and clicking on the bell so you don't miss anything. Before we have a look at multiplying negative numbers, we need to first have a look at this rule we have to have a look at multiplying negative numbers. So what this rule says is that if you have a negative number times a positive number, then the answer will be negative. If you have a positive number times a negative number, then the answer will also be negative. If you have a positive number times a positive number, then the answer will be positive. If you're multiplying a negative number to another negative number, then the answer will be positive. In other words, when you have two of the signs that are the same, your answer will be positive. When you have two of the signs that are different, your answer will be negative. Let's have a look at the first example we have, which is 8 times 5. And we can see that both of these are positive. The 8 and the 5 are both positive. So when you're multiplying two positive numbers, your answer will also be positive. Or when you're multiplying two of the same signs, the answer will be positive. So 8 times 5 will give you an answer of 40. Let's move on to the next one, which is minus 6 times 7. In this case, we have two of the different signs. We have a minus and a plus. In other words, we have a negative and a positive number multiplied together. In this case, you're going to get an answer which is negative. So that means minus 6 times 7 will give you an answer of minus 42. So you get an answer of minus 42 when you do minus 6 times 7. So what about 9 times minus 8? Well, for 9 times minus 8, we have a positive number and a negative number. So when you have two of the different signs next to each other, your answer will be negative. So 9 times minus 8 will give us an answer of negative 72. The final one we have is minus 4 times minus 2. And in this, we can see that both of them are negative. When you have two of the same signs, then your answer will be positive. So that means minus 4 times minus 2 will give us an answer of positive 8. Now to learn more on algebra, click the video on the right. And to learn the previous topic, click the video on the left. So take your pick. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.